don't need a haircut. It was really messy, but we're uh, just outside of, um, I guess, Diamond Head. There's a small park just a little bit to the east of Diamond Head Road. Um, insert B-roll footage here. <laughs> it's pretty nice outside. Um, really sunny. I figured I'd get some driving in before we get hit by possibly two different uh, tropical storms or hurricanes in the near future. The news said that they were becoming possibly later in the week or early next week. So um, while it is kind of sunny outside and there's nice weather, I'm hoping to, to shoot some video. But um, today we're going to be going kind of, I guess, right outside from Waikiki to where by Diamond Head. Uh, heading out to Hawaii Kai and then out to Sandy Beach and on the way we're going to see you know, Cocoa Head, Hanamo Bay, uh, Ants, uh, Hanamo Bay, uh, the blowhole, the Kelowna blowhole, uh, so hopefully it'll be a nice drive. Hopefully we get some good scenic footage on the way out there. Um, Right now I'm connected to, straight to my phone actually, uh, with my microphone, so I'm hoping the audio is gonna be okay. But, ah, that's it. Let's get going. All right, so here we are, in the car. Let's get going, before the sun starts going down. Yeah, like I said, I mean, there's supposed to be two storms on the way to Hawaii, and I'd rather film when it's sunny, because nobody wants to see a cloudy Hawaii. to afford. And if you follow this road all the way down to the end, it goes to the, the Kahala Hotel. Got some dolphins over there. Decent hotel. It's been there for a long time. Uh, there's a decent Italian restaurant there too, Arancino. You also get, there's some beach access like all along this road in between the houses at some points. I don't know where they are actually right now. I think there's one right here coming up on the right. No, that's a house. <laughs> Never mind, that's just a house. That was one. No, that's another house. Okay. I don't know where they are. Obviously, I don't come in here very often to go to the beach. Maybe here? Yeah, there it is. Okay, yeah, right off to the right there. <laughs> I didn't think this is another one. Oh, no, that's just a driveway. Oh, okay. So just that one. Houses. We're 
gonna make a turn coming up here to take us straight up to the highway to go eastbound toward Waikai. Kiala Olu Street, a road. I don't know, it'll be on the bottom part of the video. tempted to just slam on the gas pedal right now, but <laughs> it's a small neighborhood. I don't want to do that. Okay, right up here. Perfect timing since the traffic's not coming this way yet. To the highway. Pretty light traffic. It's still kind of the middle of the day right now. What is it? Like just past 2 30. There's a water main break up kind of close to Coco Head, so we might hit some traffic when we get out there. I was gonna film yesterday. It was briefly clear, and then all of a sudden the clouds just rolled in, rolled in, and yep, said no to that. My car's gonna stand on like a sore thumb bright red car with a GoPro sticking out of it, so people are going to be looking at me. at a camera from behind because there's a car that is like literally like 10 feet behind me right now. I'm in the right lane. If you want to pass me, go to the left, please. usually drive this way much just because the only thing I go out here to visit is Costco. I don't really like going to the one in downtown because the parking's a mess over there. This Hawaii Kai one is a lot more organized in my opinion, but to each their own. Then it's a little bit of an easier drive to get out to the Hawaii Kai Costco. 
push traffic lights at stop. Far, if you're living on Oahu, I guess, you know, but it's all relative. I mean, if you lived there your whole life, you know, 30 minutes sometimes seems like an eternity. But 30 minutes on the mainland is like, it feels like five minutes, I guess. Telling me that that SUV. Better them than me. There it is. I think we can see that water main break coming up soon. We're gonna have to merge to the left. At least it didn't close the road entirely. Slowing down, but this view is gonna be pretty nice, hopefully, on camera. <laughs> Minus the uh, yellow crane up ahead. Oh, yeah, it looks like conch flowed into uh, westbound lanes. Well, not too bad. Thank you. 
Okay, not too bad. That's like a minute. Not too bad. So I always get these names mixed up. I think the mountain in front of us is Coco Crater slash Panama Bay. And the one to our left, that's Coco Head, which has the hike per se. I'll call it a hike. It's more like you're just going up with thousand something stairs. We call that a hike. <laughs> you get a good view though of Hawaii Kai. That's for sure, but I've done it a few times and I'm, uh, I'm good, good. There's a public shooting range off to the left here. I don't think that's open yet either though. Yeah, coned off, closed. Ooh, look at that, the dark blue. Oh, they reopened uh, the lookout spots. They were closed for a while. They didn't want people like congregating in large groups, but maybe they kind of gave up on the idea. Take us too long. How long was that? About 20 minutes? I could be wrong. There's a lot of people here. <laughs> Well, we made it. I mean, minor traffic, right? But it's a 
pretty easy to get out here. Doesn't take too long and the weather's right, man. It's a good drive. It's a fun drive. But yeah, that's the end of today's video. Actually, whoa, hold on for, before we go. You can actually see, is that Molokai? Across the water over there? Yeah. Well, anyway, before I start talking about something else, yeah, that's the end of the, today's video. Um, hopefully, the footage came out really nice. I might have some audio problems, but I think I can fix that in editing somehow. But I'll do the usual YouTube shtick of, you know, like, comment, subscribe if you want to see more. Peace.